I'm here with Stephen Bowden at Fellows. Good morning, Stephen. How are you? Good morning. I'm well, thank you. Wonderful. Stephen, tell me a little bit about Fellows. So Fellows designed uh, products for offices. Um, one of the newest products out is a sit-stand device that promotes movement within the office. Movement is healthy. Changing positions as often as possible is key. Sitting down for long periods of time is a risk to our health and well-being. Um, our ancestors thousands of years ago weren't sitting all day and they weren't standing all day. They were continuously moving from the moment they woke up to the moment they went to sleep. Human beings are what's called perpetual motion machines. We're designed to move and change position. Okay. Research from NASA uh, looked at understanding how the human body deteriorates in space. Now in space, there's zero gravity and the human body literally wastes away. When we sit all day at our desks at work, or if we're standing without moving, a similar process happens. So products like Fellows product, the sit-stand products, helps promote change and helps get individuals up from sitting. Movement is easier for you. It sounds strange, but sitting all day, the body is not designed to do it. So changing positions regularly, but the research shows that the process of going from sitting to standing, that movement against gravity is the key thing for health and well-being. The more small normal movements you can do throughout the whole day, similar to our ancestors when they were hunting and gathering, changing position, they weren't sitting at desks, those normal movements against gravity, for example cleaning the car, wash, uh, cleaning the house, stretching up to lift, put something on a shelf, simple movements are what's absolutely key. We haven't got to do a marathon or a triathlon, although they're good for you, yeah. but first of all, building in normal everyday movement is fundamental to health and well-being. Okay, so at work, I would sit for eight hours. Yep. I'm at my desk, I'm at my computer. How often should I actually be standing now with this desk? What does it do? So if we're sitting all day, um, the simple process with the, with the fellow sit-stand product, there's two devices here that you can lift up and it allows us to stand. As simple as that. Now, when we want to um, sit again, the lever pushes down, clicks in, and then we can sit again. So that's part of the whole story. Okay. One part, the importance of standing. So the amount of times you should do it, the research shows from, from NASA, 32 to 36 times per day, oh. going from sitting to standing. That, that seems a lot, but that from the moment you wake up to the moment you go to sleep. So getting out of bed counts as one. Okay, so sitting is okay and standing is okay. What your key message is, is how many times you go between those two postures. It's what's fundamental to health and well-being. And tell me a little bit about yourself. Yeah, so I work as an ergonomist and I'm interested in um, health and well-being and productivity. And part of that story is movement at work. So activity-based working. Um, a lot of modern offices now are being designed to promote movement at work. We don't have to sit at our desk for long periods of time. There can be a soft seating area that we can collaborate with colleagues. There can be different areas depending on the work that we're doing. So my main interest is health and well-being and its connection with productivity. Do you have any competitors doing this? Oh, there's lots of sit-down products on the market. Uh, over the last few years, there's been lots of it um, in the media, sitting is the new smoking, and lots of interesting stuff focusing on movement at work. There's lots and lots of research backing up normal everyday movement. So a lot of manufacturers have brought out sit-stand products, sit-stand desks and products. These are good products because they can retrofit onto your normal desk. Uh, sit-stand desk, sometimes the full sit-stand desk, is quite hard to fit into an office. Because it, from a facilities point of view, it's quite awkward. This, you can take it out of the box, put it on your desk, then it can start that normal movement. That standing is one part of the story. Try and build in more normal movements from the moment you wake up to the moment you go to sleep. Thank you so much for your time you. and good luck at this expo. Cheers, thank you very much. Thank you.